Welcome to this video on solving mesh equation using the TI-89. In this example we have a two mesh circuit and we have solved the mesh for the mesh equations and for the first mesh we have minus 10 I1 plus 4 I2 is equal to minus 10 and for the second equation we have 4i1 minus 7i2 is equal to 0. We want to place those uh, equations in a determinant type format and extract out from those the coefficients. So we'll lay this out like so. And in our first equation, our first coefficient is minus 10. Then the second coefficient is 4 and the constant is minus 10. In the second equation, first coefficient is 4, then minus 7, and 0. Alright, now that we now that we have the um, coefficients extracted, then we can use our TI-89 to solve that. Uh, first we'll turn it on and then we'll set up a couple of things first. Let's go into the mode and in the mode we want to make sure that we're in the engineering format on the exponential format and then we also want to be under approximate under the exact and approximate settings. So once those are chosen just choose enter. Now we need to enter the simultaneous function uh, application so one way to do that is to choose second and press button 5 which is the math button then scroll down and select matrix scroll over and then down to so select the simultaneous functions and press enter now once in the simultaneous function we want to enter the, these coefficients and here's the order we enter them in. First we want uh, to enter a brace or a bracket, a bracket, a left bracket, then minus 10. We're going to pick up the coefficients, coefficients the top, across the top line, comma, and then 4. That takes the first equation. Now we need a semicolon to separate that. Now we want to go to the second line and pick up the second set of coefficients, which would be 4, comma, and minus 7. And now we want to close that brace, which is second and the divide sign. Now a comma, open brace, open bracket, and then now the uh, the constants. The first one was minus 10. Now we want a semicolon. And the second one, which is 0. And now we'll close that bracket. And we'll close that parentheses. And now enter. And you can see that our um, solution is I1 is equal to, we'll bring that calculator back up, I1 is equal to 1.3 amps and I2 is equal to 741 milliamps. So I1 is 1 is 1.3 amps and I2 is equal to 741 we can clean that up a little bit more seven hundred and forty one milliamps Okay, and that concludes the video on solving mesh equations using the TI-89.